Using an application parameter to define the name of the work queue will let us reference the work queue in a process without hard coding the value. This means that if we ever want to change the name of the work queue in the repository, we can just update the parameter at runtime without having to redeploy the application. In this section of the tutorial, we'll configure a work queue application parameter that references the work queue in the document and repository. As we've seen before, an application parameter functions as an application-wide variable. When we create an application parameter, we define its type and optionally specify a default value. And remember, application parameter values can be overridden in the deployment and runtime configuration settings. So in XCP Designer, in the XCP Navigator, select the Application tab, then right-click on Parameters and select New Parameter. For Label, enter Param underscore Claims Work Queue. For Type, select Work Queue and then click Finish. For Value, enter Claims Queue. So that's all there is to creating our application parameter for the Claims Queue. Let's close the Parameter Editors tab and save. Check the Problems tab for errors. OK then, we're now ready to use the application parameter when we define the stateful process for handling claims in the next section.